Thanks, Elise. Driving while distracted is a factor in about 4 million motor vehicle crashes in North America every year. When it comes to using handheld cell phones, one of the biggest causes of distracted driving, there are laws banning their use in almost every part of Canada. Fines for a first offense range from the lowest in BC at $167 to the highest $322 in the Northwest Territories. But distracted driving covers more than just talking or texting on a cell phone, which is bad enough. We're learning more this morning with Gary Howard of CAA Atlantic. Good morning. Good morning. Thanks for coming in. Thank you. Yes, distracted driving. <sighs> Not yeah, good. It's not. And uh, our recent research with um, uh, Canadians, it's now the number one concern of drivers on the road, safety wow. concern, ahead of um, drunk driving. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so when we talk about distracted driving, what are we talking about exactly? Well, there's really three different types. Hmm. So there's visual, that's your eyes off the road, um, manual, your hands off the wheel, hmm. and cognitive, which is your mind off the task. Okay. And any one of those is very, very dangerous. The, the hard part is cognitive. Right. Uh, because if you're doing anything inside your vehicle, that's not driving, mm. your mind is not on, on the task. Your mind is elsewhere, yeah. right? So yeah. if you're eating a sandwich, mind is elsewhere. So that's distracted yep. driving. It is, yeah. 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 Exactly. Even using a hands-free phone is still distracting because you're engaged in a conversation. Right. And it's not the same as having someone inside your car talking because the other person doesn't know what you're trying to react to. Right. So your reaction time uh, decreases. Mm. You know, your um, understanding what's going on um, decreases. It's just, it's a, it's a very bad situation. Mm, so that can be a cognitive distraction. Then what yeah. would be another example of a cognitive distraction? Oh, gosh, it could be anything using um, in, in uh, vehicle technology, you know, so tuning your radio or oh. using a nav system while you're driving so again you know, and if you get a combination of those things so if you're doing something you're not paying attention to the road and you're not looking at the road it mm. just becomes that much more yeah. dangerous so even when you're doing those like speech commands to your car like speech to text that kind of thing that's still distraction right exactly because that's what you're focused on right right not and on the road yeah so if you know 80 percent of all motor vehicle accidents could be avoided with mm. one more second in reaction time Ooh. so that one second you're not paying attention very dangerous yeah exactly so how do we go about uh, decreasing distracted driving well you know it uh, prepare before you get in the vehicle put your cell phone away hands-free and handheld I mean it's it's just a pure fact it's this is not something that's made up and some people think that hands-free phones are safe um, actually some research says that it's more dangerous because you spend more time on the phone thinking that it's safe oh, so your, okay. your calls like will be longer. There's a false sense of security there. Right exactly. Oh. Texting obviously 23 times yeah. more likely to be involved in an accident. Taking your road off the or eyes off the road for two seconds you travel about 90 meters. Hmm. The length of a football seconds. field. Oh wow! So think about that. Yeah, that's that's a long ways <laughs> yeah. actually that you're yeah. not looking, yeah. uh, obviously at the road. So that's a concern as well. Um, and 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 even when it comes to you know uh, distractions in the car, deal with those as well. Yeah, and you know so set your nav system to what you want to do. Get your before play you get yeah, going. Yeah, before you get going, uh, get your playlist ready uh, for your music. Um, and really understand where you're going so that you're not looking around as mm -hmm. much um, and keeping your eyes on the road. And you really have to understand what's happening around you. That's the other part of distraction, distraction is if you're not paying attention to all the other traffic, it's not just you, mm. it's all the other traffic around you and who's coming to a, a stop sign or coming onto a road and so on. Mm -hmm. So if you're not paying attention to that, your reaction time is much lower. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. You don't want that at all. So lots to talk about uh, when it comes to distracted driving and yeah. really the focus should be on your hands on the wheel, eyes on the road. That's it, you know, and you know, so we've got legislation and enforcement. Mm -hmm. The biggest part is education and making it a to a point where it's socially unacceptable. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. So that's what we're working on yeah. now. No uh, shaving in the car, which <laughs> has actually been seen. I've seen it myself. You've seen that yeah. yourself. Yeah, curling I irons. That. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you name it. Wow, yeah. don't do it. Thank you so much for coming in. Thank you. I appreciate it. A good message for sure. All right.